How's it? Today is Saturday, March 25th. It is a back squat, bench press, and sumo deadlift day, otherwise known as the SBD. Um, you could say it's small boto day. For those of you who know, you know. <laughs> um, today is scheduled to be a PR today. That was the entire goal for this whole week. I know that Monday was a deload. Wednesday was not a deload. I did not do well on Wednesday. And yesterday was yesterday. Yesterday was, was a historically bad day for me. But today I am trying to deadlift for a set of five a PR. And a little bit about that later in the video. As far as the squats go... I am at 149 today for three threes, which is what I was supposed to do for three fives and 110 on Wednesday. I ended up doing three fives and 17 because my eighth one, well, my seventh one was bad. My eighth one was a fail. Um, so I'm kind of just picking up where I left off on that. For my bench press, uh, last week I did. Two fives and one four with a fail on the fifth rep for that third set. So I am kind of looking at redoing that. So 240, I think my best in the past 5x5 five five is 242. I think it's 110 kilos. I am not entirely sure if that is true, but I think that that is correct. So I am very close to PRing that as well. Uh, I don't really care about the bench as much as... The squat or the deadlift so if I PR it cool if I don't cool um, at the end of the day today was better for squat than last week Saturday today was better for bench than last week Saturday and today was better on deadlift for last week Saturday I think for the bench I am I've resigned to not do pause bench reps I am just doing tempo not sorry tempo not tempo. Sorry, sorry. I am just doing kind of touch and go reps where I get to above 225 or so. And I think it's fine. Again, I don't really care about the bench as much as squat or deadlift. I just care that I'm doing them. Um, today at the gym, there was actually a lot of people. At Usually at like 2 o'clock or so, it's, it's cleared out and I'm just by myself doing my deadlifts. But I came into the gym a lot later than I normally do because I am off for the night. I have forfeited my shift because it's extremely slow. So I yesterday was such a waste of time. And I was like, okay, it, today might be a good opportunity to just, you know, have a nice day off. But you can see here, my boy Will. Will Park showed up today. Jason was there today. Here's my first set, by the way. Jason was there. Shaq was there. Haven't seen Shaq on a Saturday in a long time. Um, Keith was there, of course. Michelle was there. Some bald dude I don't know was there. <laughs> um, and somebody else showed up afterwards. Uh, Briss or uh, Chris Mendoza, a dude. Um, I haven't seen him in like in over a year. So it's, it was great to see a bunch of these familiar faces. Um, of course, David showed up. David showed up and didn't do any lifting. <laughs> but it is what it is. After my deadlift or my bench presses, I moved into my sumo deadlift. Of course, today is going to 185 for one set of five. So last week I went 181 for a set of three, and I claimed I could do f at least four, maybe five, possibly six at 181. 181 is like 398 pounds. And my best set of five deadlift ever is 405. And the fun fact about that lift, it's one of, it's on one of my shorts. But um, 405, that time that I did it for a set of five was the first time I've ever attempted 405 for a single. And I ended up doing five, which is pretty crazy to me. That was almost two years ago at this point, And it's really awesome for me to feel like I'm getting strong and feel like I'm not stagnating where I was, especially because I work significantly more than I used to. I think I 
am just awake a lot longer than I used to be, and I'm a lot more tired overall. So here is my last warm-up at 170. I moved to 185. This is that PR here for set of five. The first rep is actually pretty good. Uh, I think it doesn't hold up very long. Ah, that was okay. But 185 is 407. And, you know, of course, last week I went 181 for a set of three. So increasing my intensity and my volume today is probably not the smartest move. But I am super happy that I was able to do it. Um, super thankful for the guys too. Just the overall great training environment. Whew. That was a, a big challenge there. But PR's a PR and it doesn't look like I'm stoked, but I'm a little bit annoyed because this this platform is not even. So the right side of the platform is kind of rolling towards me, whereas the left side doesn't move. Um and it was really annoying for that top set because I had to kind of reset and then move it and get my hips in the right spot. But after that, I was debating on whether or not to do these down sets because I put a lot of effort into that 185. And I ended up ultimately choosing to do the down sets. Of course, you can see them right here. 167 is like 10% down. And I don't know. I'm just really happy with the progress that I've made. It doesn't feel like I've made a lot of progress, but it feels good to know that I am in an area where I'm doing all time, like lifetime PRs. And we'll see what happens at the meet coming up. I think that I would like to open at 100, but as evidence from yesterday, I don't fucking know if I can do that. That shit was crazy yesterday. I don't think I'll ever have a day where I have as many misses as that. Probably not even half as many misses. You know, half as many misses is seven misses. Um, that's way too many. But I had rationales to why I kept going, and I will stick behind it. And I am happy that I made the decision to do that because it showed me I am in a good spot, sort of mentally. But that's all for today. A really eventful day for Saturday. Um, thank you for watching. Shoots.